guys, for Blind Wave, I'm Eric. Rick. I'm Calvin. Eric, we're back with the Ruby. Last time on Ruby. Trains, trains, planes, planes, planes automobiles. automobiles. What? No, there was also an old lady. Yeah, there was. There was a <laughs> train crash and a bunch of monsters. That 100 died. 100. Grimmer attracted D. the relic. Yep. D died. That seems important. D and Dudley. Yeah, D from D and Dudley. Yes. Yes. Yep. Um, what else? Uh, they're heading uh, north to Atlas, to Argus. Yep. In Atlas. Yep. Yes. Uh, relics uh, attract bad guys. Yep. That wasn't said yet, so good job. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, I guess it's pretty much it. Sun has taken off, uh, going with the, his team, or going to meet up with his team, get back into a leadership role, maybe come back later, save the day with his yeah. monkey tail and his. <laughs> Neptune's awesome gun! Where is that shit? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. We got this for mailbag. Yeah. All right. Ba, 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 ba. Rick, hold that for the rest of the video. All right. <laughs> right in front of Calvin's face. Yep. <laughs> hold it like that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That was a Game of Thrones reaction. I held a sword and axe the whole time. Yeah. yeah. All right, now let's start. But. Ow! Wait, roosters don't have teeth. They do if you... Uh, mess with their genes a little bit. They don't, have, they don't have genes. They don't have pants, shorts, none of that. You've never been on a farm. You ever seen Don Duck? He does not wear pants. That's a duck. Just let me take this. Oh. <laughs> you need to write, Rick. He can write on the wall with bullet holes. Lady. High water bender. She reminds me of, yeah, a little bit of that, but also reminds me kind of the, like the little old Sheikah people from Breath of the Wild. So. Mm. Who is this mysterious stranger? Well, it's a woman. Raven? She has breasts. The Statues that have no titties and panties on and stuff. <laughs> the blonde is his next resurrection. Asu's gonna die. Oh, I love that. Oh, that was. That's uh, so good. It's good. <coughs> John! I do like that guitar riff there. <laughs> he was, he was late. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. Okay, send her. She fell. I knew she wasn't dead. I knew it! Of course not. What happened to her? She fell. She fell. <laughs> She's got ice in her. Yeah. Ah, that would hurt. <laughs> she lost her fight against Raven. Yeah. She has that grimoire. Yeah, I hate it. There's, there's a hole in it. And no face. Hi, face. <sighs> oh, okay, that gun went bad. Yeah. Boulder just hits her head. <laughs> yeah. Been real bad. That would be some shit if they brought her back just for that. Yeah. She died. <laughs> Cause people were like, no, she's still alive. <laughs> Salem's not gonna be happy with your failure. Nope. More failure. Yeah. Ooh, maybe she's gonna be the person in the cloak. Continual failure. Yeah, she's gotta hide her grim arm somehow. God. Are you okay? Oh. Maybe nope. this is gonna be the person in the cloak. That's nope. the person in the cloak. That's the cloak. No, that's the cloak. She's gonna it. take their cloak. No, run. No, ridiculous. Run, vegetable lady. The fruit. Eric. I think you're wrong. <laughs> I think you're the the you need wrong. to take the relic to Atlas? That's what I said. <clears throat> You've got to be joking. I mean, bright side. We finally get out of this house. So are we going well, back? Trust me, I'm not crazy about it either. And without the spring maiden here to seal the relic back in its vault, it's our best option. Atlas may be the safest kingdom we have at the moment, but their borders are closed. General Ironwood called everyone back. 
Uh, For some reason, I really like his arm thing. The city of Argus is a ways north of us, and it's the primary trading port between Anima and Solitas. They've got the largest Atlas military base outside of the kingdom. Huh. There's no way they'd leave it abandoned. And if we play our cards right, I think there's a good chance we could convince them to escort us straight to Ironwood. I mean, we do have the missing heiress of Shinida's company. Ex heiress, actually. <sighs> true, true. But if there's a chance of reward money, I say we go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, the first option will suffice. Glad to see you're feeling better. Likewise. And while I'm sure we can all use more time to recover, I'm afraid time is of the essence. Great. As long as that thing's out in the open, its power could fall into the wrong hands. Speaking of, what does it do, exactly? Crow never really told us. Yes, no more secrets. Of course. No more half-truths. The Relic of Knowledge has a wonderful and incredibly dangerous ability. It's getting bigger? Its user can ask any question, and the land will provide an answer. Really? Hmm. Intriguing. That's incredible. Indeed. <clears throat> However, it's not without drawbacks. The land cannot tell you of events that have yet to happen, and it will only ever answer three questions every 100 years. Oh, okay. shit! Well, I guess that's not so bad. Adds a lot of pressure, though. Let's put it to a vote! What do we ask for? Oh! Can we ask for more questions? Can we ask for more questions? There are no wishes. <laughs> I'm afraid you won't be able to ask it anything at the moment. The questions were used before I sealed it away. Yeah. Well, what questions? Now we know what it is. And we'll be sure to keep it safe. Doesn't seem that powerful, then. No, doesn't seem super useful to the bad guys <coughs> at the moment. Great, this is just the train. great. Yep. We're stranded. Is it just like on Charter? Part of our party, and we have gained a defenseless old lady. <laughs> I don't think that bike's going My name now. is Maria Caravera, and I am not defenseless. I'm just a little hard of hearing and blind without my eyes. That are in desperate need of repair. No. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm starting to see your point. Yeah. Yang, knock it off, will ya? If we lose our cool now, we'll just be inviting even more Grim. Does that even matter? Apparently, we've been attracting Grim since we left Haven. Oh, and how could I forget about that? What happened to no more lies and half truths? Yeah. I think it's time we got an explanation. Did not lie to you. Well, you certainly didn't tell us everything about the relic. Please, now is not the time. No, we're past that. I want to know why you're still not telling us everything. It is true that the Grim are attracted to the relics. It's faint but undeniable. I believe it has to do with their origin, but I'm not entirely sure. Regardless, I feared that making you all aware would only add anxiety and negativity. It seems like the safer option. You know, I'm getting real tired of people choosing what's best for me. Is that why you chose to lie to everyone about Lionheart too? Yes, as a matter of fact. I believe the Kingdom of Mistral deserved better than the truth. And I believe Leonardo deserved to be remembered for his lifetime of service, and not the unfortunate missteps he made in his final years. Missteps? What Professor Lionheart did was reprehensible. I am not here to argue differently. But does one lapse in judgment truly negate all of his good? Do we not all have regrets? You may have met Professor Lionheart, but you never met the man who was before Sailing Fountain. Look, we're supposed to be in this, together! You can trust us! We're not gonna turn our backs on you! Do you really think Leo wasn't the first? <clears throat> that he didn't say those exact same words to me? I'm sorry, but you have to understand that my behaviors are backed by experience. I'm not saying that I have reason to think you will betray me. I'm saying that I have reasons for the things that I do, the secrets I keep. The reason I... Where's the relic? Where's the relic? Yeah, where is it? It's in, in the, the snow. snow. Oh, okay. Thanks, Ruby. It got scattered in the crash. Please, end it over. 
So all those times you talked about having faith in humanity, that was just for everyone else? Uh, that's not what I meant to suggest. Miss Rose, the relic is a powerful item, and I simply feel as though it is my burden to bear. But you said it couldn't do anything right now. Why does it matter who carries it? I need you to listen to me. Buzz? Hurry. He's trying to stop you. Huh? Stop her from what? It's Os Oscar and Osmond. He finds uh, what he's hiding. Her name is Jim. Say her name to summon her. What? <clears throat> Did he lie about how many times you can ask him questions and stuff? He lies a lot, man. There's more to it than just what he told us. Ask this thing what's going on! <laughs> <coughs> Fairy. I was gonna say, yeah. <laughs> Bro's like, oh. <laughs> He's like, <"Dang." laughs> Oh shit! It's like Shiva from Final Fantasy. <clears throat> Hell yeah, I love this. I love this genie. Right? Yeah. Yeah, it's nothing. Tell me. Right. Jin. What knowledge do you seek? Where are your nipples? Eric. Sorry. Is that the question you choose to ask? <laughs> <coughs> All right, here she is. She's in her cloak. It's Cinder. No. Oh. Eric. Oh. Last. Night. Put your hood up. She cut her hair. Yeah. Nice. All right. So is Torch we're gonna find her? That was, is that what the deal was with the hat with the flying hat? in the intro? Maybe. This is a really good machete. She's trying to get the <laughs> relic back before she goes back to Salem. I don't know. Maybe she's trying to hide from Salem really like and shot. everyone else. I don't know. This is a really cool shot. Dang. It's like Jasmine from Aladdin. The web. It's a symbol. Okay. Ooh, good. That's good. That's far enough. <clears throat> it's a lot of blind white okay. bucks. Okay, you can come closer. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Come sit on my lap. Your little Miss Malachite. I'm little miss gonna skin you alive if you ever take that tongue with me again. Looks like your life savings. It was somebody's. Oh. <laughs> Cute. What do you want for it? I'm looking for these travelers. <clears throat> well, sweetheart, you came to the right place. <laughs> A little jumpy today, hmm? You know, I used to be afraid of spies. Want to know what I did about it? Made into a symbol. Oh, yeah. no. Take notes, Aaron. The world needs spies. I just made the spiders work for me. Do that with needles. I don't think that works that way, right? Yeah, it does. It's proven. In two occasions. <laughs> Give us a week. We'll find your travelers. Little well, Miss, we already know where they are. That big guy asked about them last week. I know mm. we know. But 
But what we don't know is who here in Mistral might be asking about her. <coughs> the god of light to aid humanity in its pursuit of knowledge. I've been graced with the ability to answer three questions every 100 years. You're in luck, as I am still able to answer... That's enough! Two questions this era. Mm. It's a pleasure to see you again, old man. Ruby, please, don't. Hey. Get your sword down. Do whatever you think is right, kiddo. Jin? What is Ozpin hiding from us? No! no. Uh, she's gonna answer the question we're gonna show her. Twice! Yang! Morpheus. Blake! What happened? Ruby! It's not just her. Ruby! Yang! Once upon a time. Ooh. There stood a lonely tower. Where's my blanket? That sheltered yeah, a lonely story. girl. Ah, <clears throat> huh? uh, the bond! Named Salem. Oh, Salem. it's Salem. Okay. Don't. She looks done. Wait, no! Don't! No! What? No! Work. Just when we're just when we're getting in there. Full length back to YouTube. There's a full length. But we there start the whole no thing on YouTube. <laughs> YouTube yeah. back to YouTube. Give it the program. <laughs> Dang. Uh, so what? So were they siblings, lovers? They were lovers. Something of the such, Ozpin right? Ozpin turned her yes. evil and created the Grim, trying to bring her back from the dead. That's what I think. I mean, she can control the Grim, right? Or is that what they're working towards? Her controlling the grim. Wasn't there something like that? Like, or weird she was like tentacle like mm, things, and mm. like they, weren't they utilizing the grim for like their own stuff too? Well, Osman said something about the relic maybe being part of the grim's origin. So does he know the origin? He's not telling. Well, yeah, it's about Salem. It's all tied together. I need to fucking know. I don't. I don't know any of this shit. I was. I was I'm happy to getting some answers. I've been desperately needing for two volumes. <laughs> he looks like Osman doesn't have the, the Osman voice much anymore, does he? Mean? It's basically just Oscar talking, but like he's Ospin. Well, used to be... all the times that we heard Ospin talking was an internal voice to yeah. Oscar. I thought that sometimes he it used his voice, too. I thought they've been using the different voices. I don't know. I thought, I don't know. I thought all the watched, times that we heard... Like, whenever we would see Oscar go from, like, Oscar to Ospin in the last couple volumes, was ever using his... It sounded like Ospin. It, it sounded like Ospin to me. Yeah. I just thought it was one of those things where it's like, you know, because he's been doing Oscar's voice or Oscar doing Ospin's voice. Ospin, what are you saying? Ospin's own voice coming out of Oscar's character model. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's, we used to have that. We don't have that anymore. Now it's just Oscar, but he's talking. It's Oscar's voice actor talking as if he's Ospin. Really? Yeah. Like in this, that was Ospin's. When he's like saying no and all that stuff, that wasn't his voice actor. I thought actor. it was going back and forth between the two of them. It used to, but I don't think it did this episode. Okay. Now we know that, unless I'm wrong, but we know that Ospin like is slowly going to fade away, right? Right. Isn't that the idea? Like Oscar will slowly take over, and he's kind of guiding the next, uh, the next reincarnation Oscar, yeah. or whatever it is. They'll merge. Yeah, they'll merge and form like know. a new personality. I've or always something. somewhat doubted that, as if Oscar will slowly fade away and yeah. Ospin will take over. Oh yeah, I doubt everything now. Yeah. Like he lies about everything. Well, he's been betrayed before. Experience tells him that he needs to keep things close to the chest. I mean, yeah. maybe the reason is because he was betrayed by Salem. Mm -hmm. If he yeah. was familiar with Salem back whenever there was the one tower. Uh, it's like place. Merlin and yeah. um, it's, Morgana. I mean, it'll Morgana. probably go back to it's his fault. Salem probably still made a choice, but it's probably still initially his fault. 
I'm gonna say. Yeah. Right? He can be like seen as like the villain of the story in a way. I just fucking wish it didn't end there. Damn. <sighs> Me too. I know. All right. Well, that's the that's the second of the three wishes that you can use in the next era. I, don't, I wonder how much time they have left. I wonder what the first was. Yeah. Like, is it you use up three and then it's a hundred years from the third Did, one? Didn't before. I might be remembering. Did he say 500 years originally? No. He no. Said, did he say 100? 100 years. He said 100. Okay. Yeah. First I thought he said like longer than 100. You can uh, say three every 100 years. Yeah. But I wonder if that means like if you ask the first one 50 years ago, does the 100 years start counting after you've used the third well, one or once you start using the first one? I would guess the first one, if it was 50 years ago, comes back in 50 years. Yeah. So it's 100 years per wish would yeah. be my guess. So every yeah. wish just refreshes in... Just every 33 years, years you ask a wish, and you just keep getting wishes. Either that, or you get, you know... At well, the, not a wish. At the wish. dawn of a new 100, right? That's what I mean. So from... It's 2000 now, so when it's 2100, you get three wishes. It okay, could be you like You use yeah. the three wishes during the 2000... Because yeah. they don't have any Otherwise, rollover. Otherwise, they go away. Yeah. <laughs> you don't get rollover minutes. Yeah, yeah, they don't roll over. No rollover Man, minutes. fuck that. <laughs> you can wait a little bit, get like six questions. <laughs> So I wonder if all of the relics summon a, like a demigod. Or a genie Maybe. or whatever. I like her. Do you? <laughs> you, had, you had a question for her, right? Yeah. I forgot. Did you? Or it's already been answered. <laughs> Cinder. Yeah. Cinder is tracking them down. Guy. She has not gone back to Salem. Mm -hmm. Nope. I assume she wants to Maybe rectify Regine. her failure. Yeah, she yeah. doesn't want to be a... Complete failure again yeah. after the silver, I think. Yeah. So she is in disguise. She <coughs> killed that poor vegetable woman. Yeah. Stole her cloak. Stole all of her money. Or maybe. Well, she... I think she stole someone else's money. <laughs> yeah. I was wondering if Cinder would switch sides, knowing like how dangerous Salem is. Would she be like, oh, it might be better for me to join up with this side because she's gonna kill me. But she may just be trying to like, well, if I go kill them and do it and finish the job that I was supposed to do, Salem will be okay with me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You think she's gonna be like, uh, what's the Zuko? Oh, yeah. Possibly. He has a scar for it. It depends on what happens. Like the big guy, that was that should be the one guy, right? Like uh, he, Bane. Uh, yeah, like he, he like blocks weapons <laughs> yeah. with his arms and stuff, right? Yeah. I can't remember what his name was, but he, he injects himself with crystal. Yeah, that guy. Yeah, yeah. I can't yeah. remember. Imagine that was the big guy that came asking before. I would assume. So what was I think his he, name, Eric. He, he's the biggest guy we've seen. Bear. Rit. No. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I didn't take I notes why I banished. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I, didn't have, I don't have a book that I kept from back then. Yeah, I don't have a book either. I mean, I started a rewatch, but I've only got, like, volume two. <laughs> <laughs> You're weak, Eric. I am weak. The big beast Wolverine guy. Yeah. All anyway. I have is Vernal <laughs> written down. I like how that was the, girl. the Jen can show them. Like not just tell them. Yeah, yeah. no, it's yeah, cool. it's it's kind of like well, I, I I joked by saying oh Morpheus because it was very Neo yeah. in the construct. But yeah. if that's what's gonna happen, that's exactly it's, what that's gonna be. It's giving her yeah. like everything. I also thought it was interesting. Like w they're all alone seeing it, and I, it's interesting what voice they caught out first. Like Ruby didn't call out her sister first; she called out Weiss first. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and Weiss called out Ruby. Yeah, and then Blake I don't, I don't know if that means Yang. anything, but. It's just like who's closest to each other. I mean, it could be related to with uh, like back in the first volume, the the pairs that they created first. Like you, whenever they had to lock eyes sure. in that forest, they had to lock eyes with their partner, which was Ruby and Weiss and Blake and Yang, and That's then true. those partners Good became catch. a team. So maybe yeah. it's more related to that, and how like these were the partners that were paired together. True. So yeah. I don't know. I never noticed that Oscar's last name was Pine. Oscar Pine, Oz Pine, Oz Pen. Yep. I don't know. It's just mm -hmm. interesting. Oh. uh... I thought we talked about that when we learned his name. Calvin. I mean, it was like you a very... Years ago? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's been a while. Uh, you know, I I also joked about, oh, Uncharted 2, like train scene, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But this also had a flashback, and then you flash forward back to the yeah. the train scene. It's very reminiscent of Uncharted 2. Yes. Yeah. true. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay, well, that works. It's not something that I hate. It just... Yeah. Yeah, no, no, I'm, I'm not. I have to saying. roll with it. And... I mean, I think it's more of like just a coincidence than it is like. Yeah, yeah. We're, you know, what we're gonna steal. Well, <laughs> let's do what they do. Yeah. Okay, so the relic of knowledge can ask any question. Have three questions every 100 years. Can't tell the That's... future. Colleen no. Clinkenbeard. 
That's good. I like because... that. I like that you can't just be like, you know, what are the lottery numbers next week? And yeah. Like, here they are. It can tell you the past, like what someone hiding. It can hiding. tell you knowledge. You, know, yeah. you could ask, like, what is this guy's password to his computer, you know, and then you can get into it. Like, you could ask those kind of things. So uh, there are things I think that could be bad for someone bad to get a hold of, mm-hmm. but it's not all powerful and, like, I don't think it's, uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't imagine it to be too terrible, but maybe there's some information that people get a hold of would be bad. Yeah. Man, uh, hospitals. How do I live forever? How do I get more questions? Yeah. Yeah. I've, I've made... People ask the questions, too, and then it's no good for 100 years, you know? Like... <laughs> yeah. I've definitely... I've made the Dumbledore, Ospin, uh, <clears throat> like comparison. comparison before, but, you know, having all of these lies and you pr- to protect people and stuff like that, it's very similar. Yeah. Yeah. I don't okay. know. The wizard from The Wizard of Oz was... He was lying the whole time about it all was. kinds of shit, you know? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, all right. So, I, yeah, I, you know, the intro thing, I think we've kind of gotten all the in- answers for the intro. Yeah. Right? Yeah. With, uh, the, who's the girl? Mm-hmm. Salem. And then uh, who's the old lady? She's Maria. Maria uh, Caviera? Can't see very well. Yeah. Or at all right now, I and guess. And then we have, what was it, Little Miss uh, Malachite or something like that, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the, Malice the, the, Mal, yeah, something like that. The owner of like the spidery place. Yeah, they have like spider web like agents. I don't know. Is that like, is that what that's? It's probably to be? the dark web. It seems like a thieves the guild or something. Yeah. Hmm. Something. What? The, it could be the dark. Little, ah. Yeah, Little Miss Malachite. It's the dark web. He's got a chaos. Yeah. Okay. That's what <laughs> <laughs> thank you guys for too. Guys, thank you very much for watching this episode of Ruby with us. Uh, the next reaction is currently available at patreon.com slash waterway. Uh, you guys can check out that for access. Okay, but if not, we'll see you back here every Saturday for the next many Saturdays. And make sure you subscribe to the next one. Yep. Oh my god!